everybody. Good night. Good night. Good evening. Whichever, you know, welcome in. Come on and say hello. We'll get started here in a little bit. Um, late night jewelry with me. I like I like the late nights and I like the early mornings. I don't know. I like them both, I suppose. I don't know why I'm talking so low. <laughs> I don't know if you can even hear that. <laughs> so welcome in, everybody. Come on in. Say hello. Uh, per usual, I got some costume, and I do have some sterling silver as well, so it's going to be a little a mix of each. Scoota, what's up, girl? What's happening? Welcome in. Did you, uh, hello, how did you like the movie? Did you like it? Top Gun is what you went and saw, right? No, Ashley messaged me the other day. She's like, I'm so excited to go see Top Gun. I guess Top Gun's coming out. <laughs> I didn't even know. I'm going to fix my chat here. Oh, no, what did I do? Hold on, hold on. You think I'd know by now. It's not my first day. <laughs> I loved it. Sweetness. Cool dude. I saw that uh, Robert posted saying, you spilled an entire soda. <laughs> and then he spilled popcorn. So it's okay, you know. <laughs> Did you end up uh, moving seats? <laughs> What's up, Len Lindsay? Welcome in. Hello, hello. Oops. Oh, shucks. Thanks for coming, guys. I'll give it a little bit more time here, then we'll get the ball on the road here. Oh, Scoot, did you go to any flea market and stuff today, too? Did you find some good stuff? Uh, Leslie's in the house. What's up, Leslie? Welcome in. Hello, hello. What's up, T? Long time no see. Hope you're doing well, girl. Nice to see ya. And then Julie McIntyre's in the house. Hey, uh, Julie, welcome, welcome. I did. Gracious. <laughs> I totally missed a cup holder. And when I went to put my drink back, nice. <laughs> well, at least you didn't get yourself. A sitting through a whole movie being soaking wet. Yuck. <laughs> That's annoying. <laughs> Three markets and got some sloth slippers. Is that what those were? Cool dude. <laughs> oh my god. Her and her sloth. <laughs> What's up, love? Welcome in. You guys are still awake. I'm excited. All right, guys, we got 10 people in the house. I'm going to get the show on the road here. Luckily, it hit the floor and didn't get on me, right? That would have been terrible. <laughs> All right, wish me luck. Hopefully, my camera doesn't uh, mess up while I, uh, I change it. Let's see. If it, for, for some reason, if it does mess up, just st stick around. I'll be back in like two minutes. Yes, <laughs> I like it when things work out the right way. All right, sweet. Okay. Lisa Jenkins is in the house. What's happening, Lisa? Welcome in, everybody. Everybody in the club getting tips. All right. Well, oh, maybe some of you are. I don't really know, though, you know. What's up, Rev? <laughs> oh, doggy. Who's that hottie with the glasses? <laughs> oh, my God. You're too much, Rev. <laughs> well, thank you very much. <laughs> I was going for that hottie look. <laughs> All right, guys. This is brand new. Ashley, what's happening, girl? She made it. You're still awake. All right. I'll try not to wake up, Kelsey, okay? I'll try. Uh, Kraken's in the house. What's happening, Kraken? Welcome in. Thanks for coming. Okay, guys. First thing right here, $1 start. This is brand new in the package. You got this little SeaWorld lapel pin here. Look at the cute little dolphin. Isn't he cute? It says SeaWorld right there. I uh, got the big old, I don't know, like that flirty eye going on there. Picky Nikki's in the house. What's happening, Picky? It's originally $7.99 over at SeaWorld. Now the package did get like ripped open a little bit, but nonetheless, he's still still good to go. Picky and Nikki is here. What's up, girl? Alright, guys. All kinds of love tonight. Look at all the hearts and such. Hearts and flowers and smiley faces. You guys are awesome. Shadow Woman. What's up, uh wait give me a minute Rhonda yes what's up Rhonda at the moment I'm like is that the right person yes it is what's happening girl all right if there's no interest in the little sea world dolphin pin that's okay that's all right I'm gonna push it off to the side give me a minute here I, I'm, I'm working on you know some things you know see I got that added to my room yes today not yesterday but for the moment I do want to do this 
Let's see if this works. I don't really know, though. Eh, no, I don't like it. Just give me a minute again. Sorry. You guys are my little guinea pigs. <laughs> so I got a shell necklace, all right? All right. Um, it's got two layers. We're going to do a, uh, let's just do a $1 start on this here. We got Mike in the house. What's happening, Parks at? Yo, 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 who likes pickles? I do. I really do. Just finishing invoices finally. It won't be long. <laughs> All right. Here we go, guys. Here is your, uh, let me just get this situated, sorry. Here is your clasp on it right here. Now, it's not in the best of condition, but for the clasp, it does have some, some uh, tarnishing on it. But if you like those shells, I got two strands on this necklace for you. All kinds of shells. Different shapes, colors, sizes. Looks like some abalone on there. You're going to get two strands. Two of them. For one dollar. You got it. Oh, it was B. <laughs> we can do that. All right. And if there's no interest in the shells, out ski, see ya. Let's do um. Let's do this little guy. It's a cute little brooch. We're gonna do a three dollar start. Oops. Three dollars to start on this. Nice silver tone and gold tone. You got the cowboy hat there. With the gold tone chain. Whoops. There's the back of that brooch. Yeehaw, cowpoke. <laughs> Picky is in for three, looking for four. <laughs> Ashley's in for four, looking for five on this. Tank you, tank you. There it is. This needs a little clean up, got a little bit of, you know, dirt and such, but that's all right. Picky is out ski, so we're going to go once to Ashley for four, looking for that $5 bid. Same old, same old. Yep. <laughs> going twice. Last call, y'all. And sold to Ashley. Thanks, Ashley. Appreciate it. All right. The next one here, let's just... uh. Let's just roll with this for a quick second here. It is brand new in the package. It's a fashion bracelet. We're going to do a $1 buy it now on this. You know, strength, trust, devotion, love. You got your toggle class. You got family, honor, and charity as well. $1 buy it now on this. Picky, sold to you. Thank you, Picky. Right, let's see. Oh yeah, Picky, I didn't check the comments in the past hour, but I'm pretty sure you won that Vera Bradley lot. Thank you very much for that. Appreciate it. Okay, let's go with um we're gonna go with this one real quick. So how I'm doing is do this. The chain has some tarnishing on it. Like the clasp is good and stuff, but the chain down below does have some tarnishing. I was gonna do a one dollar buy it now, sell it as craft. Did he sleep? I think he's sleep bidding. <laughs> uh, but I figured you could take these pieces off and put it on a new chain. Because all the stones are there. You get the pink acrylic, the blue acrylic, and you get all the rhinestones. Super pretty. <laughs> but the, the chain does have some tarnishing, so I figured you could take these pieces off and put it on a new necklace. So if there's any interest in that, my eyeballs are burning. <laughs> I was having trouble keeping it together earlier. I was so tired. <laughs> Took a little cat nap and boy, did that do wonders. All right, this is out of here. Out of here. The next one here. This is all acrylic, but it's super pretty. You have all the, the rhinestones and they all seem to be present. Nice light. Uh, we're going to go with like a mint green color. 
You get the lobster claw class and the extender. Here is the back. And we're going to do a $1 start on this one as well. $1 start. It's just a pretty mint green color. With all the rhinestones on it. Take a gander at that there for a minute. A gander. <laughs> just checking out this necklace. Right? They, they do a lot of good, I tell you what. Some days, you know, those naps turn into like three-hour naps, and some days it's like 20 minutes and you feel awesome, you know? just depends on, on the day. <laughs> All right. I'm going to pull it. She's out of here. This next one here, this one's got a sterling silver uh, toggle clasp. I just measured it, but I already forgot just that quick. Um, you're looking at 16 inches on this. Time for coffee, Nikki. <laughs> So it's a 16 inches long sterling clasp. Um, let's do a let's just do an eight dollar start on it. This is really pretty. Right now it's more like bear naps, mini hibernation. <laughs> Some days. There's that. So you got glass. Um, I did not test that for amethyst, but it sure looks like amethyst. But I'm just gonna call everything glass just uh just in case. But I think there's some stone in here too. You got this real pretty, like, uh, I think it's called cloisonne. Cloisonne bead. Some fun colors in there. Sterling silver clasp. You got some blues, purples, and greens. A little bit of red in there as well. There we go. $8 on this. There. Got it. Got it all situated. Little, little Nikki. <laughs> what is that? What does that say? Hmm, we'll figure it out together. This is me living on the edge and chat at midnight. <laughs> All right, guys. I will pass it. But there's no interest. The next thing. It's a cute little brooch. It's gold tone. <laughs> An abalone. We're going to do a... Three dollars start on this. Oops. Thanks, Scoot. Appreciate that. Yeah, don't forget the thumbs up. Beautiful abalone right here. Nice gold tone. It does have a, a marking on it. It says it's just like a capital K. I'm not sure who that would be, what that is, but it's a capital K. But that abalone is like, bam, in your face. You're looking at about an inch and a half-ish, a little bit more. Burning, don't tell me you smoke in Lewis. <laughs> Any interest in that? All right, guys. I'm pulling it. It's out of here. The next thing, let's do this. I believe this is vintage. It has to be because it's it's really small. Um, so <laughs> you're looking at like 11 inches without the extender, but thankfully you do have like a three and a half inch extender. And Picky is in for three on the abalone brooch. All right, girl, that one's sold to you. Whoops, sorry guys. Thank you, thank you. So this is a necklace. We're gonna do a uh, sort of three dollar start on this too. But again, it's like eleven inches at its shortest length without the um, extender. But you do have a three and a half inch extender. You get the hook clasp and big old giant faux pearls. They are acrylic, and you get the gold tone spacer beads in between there. So again, it has to be it has to be vintage. There's no other explanation for it. <laughs> no shopper girl was here. She'd be like, yes or no. She'd be telling us something. So three dollars on that. Okay. Three dollars. All right. 
big ol' big ol' full pearls. Slingshot ammo, you totally, absolutely. You could take out a couple chipmunks with these guys for real though. <laughs> Alright. If you change your mind, you know what to do, guys. <laughs> Those would hurt, man. They seriously, they would really, really hurt. <laughs> This one, this one's really kind of heavy. Um, it's marked something AM, and I think it goes like on a on a tie. Let me show you what's going on. Uh, let's just do this at a three dollar start. It's heavy. It's a real pretty. It's a real pretty horse. Hey, Lee B, welcome in. Thank you, thank you everybody for hanging out with me tonight. Real pretty horse. You got your. A M marking over here, but then here is here's that. Is that for a tie? I forget. Oh, there you go. And it's kind of thick. It's for a bolo. Hey Mari, welcome in. Oh yeah, duh. Okay, that's why I've seen it before. <laughs> Julie, Julie is in for three, looking for four. D to D. It's all right. It's fine. <laughs> Three dollars. Looking for four dollars on this guy. <laughs> Man, that looks familiar. Can't quite put my finger on it though. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, going once. Uh, to Mari. No, no, to Julie. Sorry, for three dollars. Looking for that four dollar bid. <laughs> going twice. Last call, y'all. Fair warning and sold to Julie. Thank you, Julie. <laughs> the next thing I got coming up here, I got two bracelets. One is undyed Howlite. The other one is dyed Howlite. Let's do a $4 start uh, for both. So they are stretchy. These would be great pieces to take apart and repurpose. Or if you like it just the way it is, then there you go. So this one's undyed, and then you've got the one that is dyed. You've got some light, light blue, pink, darker blue, purple, yellow, and green. Oh, and orange. Look at the orange one. And then you get this one. So they are stretchy, and they are stone. I'll bring that down just a little bit here. Picky is in for $4 on these, looking for 5 Let's say no, nope, it won't. Any other interest? Any at all? Alrighty, guys, we're gonna go once to pick you for four. I just had sushi with eel. Ooh, I haven't had sushi in a long time, but I, the eel on the top was pretty good the last time I had it. Last call and sold. Thank you, picky. Picky for four. Cool. All right. All right. Okay. Let's see. This next one. This one's beautiful. I. I. There's a lot. <laughs> there is a lot of rhinestones here. Um, I looked it over. I think everything is there. I'm doing it again before I put it up. Hold on, just a second. I'm trying to give it another look over. But of course, if you see something, you let me know. Mm. Okay, I think we're good, guys. So this is a stunner. It's not marked. Look at that. Um, we're going to do an $8 start on this necklace here. Tons, and I mean tons, of rhinestones. You get the lobster claw class and the extender. Jennifer's in the house. What's happening, Jennifer? Welcome in look at that again i i mean there's a lot to look at but i i triple checked it to make sure that all the stones are there but my eyes started going a little bit fuzzy so i might have missed one but i don't think so there's the back of it and it, this one is articulated as you can tell picky comes in for eight dollars on this looking for nine all right 
I'm going to kind of leave it get it to focus again. And I'm not going to touch it. We got Picky at $8, looking for $9 on this. Ashley's in for 9 looking for 10 Like, you got hundreds of different types of stones. You got some yellow, some blue, some green, some blue-green, some AB-coated, some clear. Um, the light blue right there. I don't know, man. It's awesome. Pinky's in for 10 looking for 11 We need to a little ride around the necklace, okay? Ashley's at 11 looking for 12 We're going for a ride. Yeehaw! What? <laughs> All right. Well, there we go. That was our ride, folks. Oh, wait. What's going on here? Hello? Sorry. Ashley's at 11, looking for 12. <laughs> There's that. Take a gander. Maybe this one. Picky is out. All right. I'm gonna go once to Ashley for 11 on this, looking for $12. Going twice. Last call, y'all. Air warning and sold to Ashley. Thank you, Ashley. Okay. That one's pretty. You're going to love it. Let's see. This one here. So you got a sterling silver chain which is 16 inches long. You do have a circle spring clasp. And this is a brand new chain. And then this is also a brand new pendant and it's bone carved. It's, you get the Thunderbird there with the sterling silver bail. Turn that down a little bit. Um, so 16 inch roll chain. We're gonna do a $25 start on this necklace. Turn that up a little bit. There you go. So this is carved bone. There's your Thunderbird right there. Super cool. I got these in the other day. I said, I'm going to bring some to the YouTube, and then whatever doesn't sell here, I'll bring it over to my booth. A real pretty 16-inch roll chain with the Thunderbird uh, pendant. And again, the chain and the bail are both sterling. So take a look at that for a second. I'm going to look for some. Oh, I wanted to test this stone. That's what I was trying to do. Let me test this, and then we'll go from there. Calibrate it. Okay. Yes, that's right. You got the wolf. In the skull, that's what it was. Those were cool. Oops. Oh, shoot. Okay. All right. If there's no interest in this, that's okay. I'll put it right over here. I got another sterling silver necklace. It is a jade pendant. The chain is 14 inches long. So 14 inch long chain. That's a jade pendant. We're going to do this at a... Uh, thirty dollar start. I'll show it to you better here. You got a beautiful jade right here. I just tested it. It is prong set. That's the type of bezel that it's on. There you go. You got your nine two five marking here. And I'm not sure what you call this type of chain, but it's really really smooth. And then you get your lobster claw clasp. Super pretty. So the chain is 14 inches, and then you get a nice jade pendant there. I'm going to keep it sideways so it fits into the camera better. And then the pendant itself is um, about an inch and a half, inch and a half or so, but super, super cool. You got it, Jennifer. 
Okay, let me get a measurement on this. Shortness is 17. All right, I'm going to pull that one here. We're going to do this one at a $3 start. We got a lobster claw clasp. No, no signature on it. At its shortest length, you got 17 inches. You got glass and gold tone. Um, hold on a second. What's that? And acrylic. And I'll show you better here in a second. This is really pretty. It's a nice, fun necklace. You got three layers here. I just love the colors on it. Check it out. There you go. Okay. So you got some faceted glass beads. Uh, from what I can tell, these pieces um, are acrylic pieces. And then it looks like you might have some um, stone chips in there too, possibly. But in great condition. Super fun. Nice colors. We got orange and blue, yellow, purple, green. There's that. Okay. So three dollars to start on this one here. What does that say? Julie is in for three, looking for four. Thank you, thank you. We have three dollars, looking for four dollars. Just a little bit of noise for a second there. Okay, alrighty, folks. We're going once to Julie for three. Going twice. Last call, y'all. Fair warning and sold to Julie. Thank you, Julie. All right. And since my camera is already set like this, let's. Uh, do another necklace real quick. Let me give it a quick once over. I haven't really looked at this one yet. Okay, so with this one here, you are looking at a measurement of, oh, wait a minute. Oh, about 16 inches, but you got a few inches of extender. So real pretty red and clear stones we're going to do this one at a four dollar start and i do believe it's a dana buckman nice gold tone so here is your your tag on this i think that's dana buckman but i'm not totally sure here's your lobster claw you got your two strands here's what the back of the necklace here looks like and then you get the nice red and clear uh clear stones super clean necklace Great condition. I'm going to put it back down here before I mess it all up. <laughs> Real nice. There. So $4 to start on the Dana Buckman. Jennifer's in for four on this, looking for five. Thank you, thank you. She's back. Welcome back, Jennifer. All right. We're going to go once to Jennifer for four. Looking for that $5 bid. Going twice. Last call, y'all. Fair warning. Sold to Jennifer. Thank you, Jennifer. That's pretty. The next one, um, let's see. I'll bring that back down there. This one is marked Coro. He also gave me the jade pendant and necklace for 30. You got it, Jennifer. Thank you so much. You're going to like that one. That was awesome. We're going to do a $5 start on this one. This one is Mark Coro. Too much light. Um, you got the blue-green, like a magenta, an amber color, and you got the clear rhinestones, gold tone. 
here's the back of it here. Your coro mark is right near where my thumb is. The pin does stick out just a tidbit there. Hey, Judy, welcome in. Judy is in for five on this, looking for six. Five dollars, looking for six dollars. Oh, about uh, just I'd say about an inch and three quarter or so. Let me get Jennifer's in that bag there. Oh, shoot, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Sandy Kirk's in the house. What's happening, Sandy? Welcome in. All right, got you, girls. All right, and we got Judy at five, looking for six on the Coro. About an inch and three quarter or so long. All right, oops, oops. We're going to go once to Judy for five. Going twice. Last call, y'all. And sold to Judy. Thank you, Judy. Appreciate it. Okay. This next one. All right. Bear with me. I want to try something. <laughs> Story of my life. I'm going to try it out on this necklace first since it's already there. And if it works, <laughs> I'll put another necklace on it. How about that? Does that sound good? Okay, we're going for a ride, guys. Going down. We're going this way. Woo -hoo. Um, kind of, sort of works. It's a really big... All right, well, it's not working as good as I had wanted it to. <laughs> let's be honest here. Um, let's do this as a $1 start. Make sure I didn't miss anything. I love your late night shows. Well, Eastern time. Good. Glad you're liking the late nighters. It works out perfect because everyone's in bed, so might as well do some. <laughs> so this isn't working out quite as much as I wanted to, but it's a red acrylic necklace that hangs down. <laughs> you got the silver tone chain. Try not to make anybody seasick here. Uh, you got your lobster claw clasp and the extender there. I'm dizzy from the ride. I'm sure you are. I would be too if I was you guys. Not gonna lie. Hey, I gotta test it somehow, some way. Oh, that's not bad. So there you go. One dollar to start on that. <laughs> and it's in great condition. Oh, excuse me. I've been here and there. <laughs> Ready, guys. And if not, that's okay. I'm going to pull it. Um, maybe I'm not going to pull it. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Let's see. This is the one that I wanted to show you. It's marked Hong Kong, Kong on the, the clasp. You're looking at about 20 inches. This one is most definitely vintage. But here's your clasp. It's like a push-pull. I might have to go back to the other one. Mark Hong Kong. All right, guys, I'm sorry about that. We're going back. Let's go for another ride. If I want to do that, I think I'm going to need a riser. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're back. We're back and on track. Uh, we're going to do a $5 start on this necklace. And it, it screams vintage. Like, seriously. You got your Hong Kong over here. And you got your one, two, six strands. They are all acrylic. And they get about 20 inches long. Judy is in for five on this, looking for six. Super pretty, though. And it seems to be in excellent condition, as far as I can tell. Any other interest in this? I know she knows. Okay. Oh, bummer. That's the line of craft box. Okay. And if not, I'm going to go once to Judy for five, looking for that $6 bid. Going twice. 
last call, y'all. Soul to Judy. Thank you, Judy. Appreciate it. All right, the next one I got is a sterling silver. It needs a little polishing up. I believe it is vintage. And it's a brooch. We're going to do a $15 start. Okay, there you go. Got it. So this one here, you're looking at about um, three inches. Turn this down here. So here it is. It's a nice big old piece. You got your sterling silver marking um, right over here, and it is spelt out sterling. And then the tip, the pin does stick out a little bit here. So you need to give it a little bit of elbow grease, polish it up a little bit. It's a nice vintage sterling pin. Looking for 15 on that. There we go. So here's that. It almost looks like, I don't know, like some sort of a instrument of, of something. I'm not totally sure, but that's what it kind of reminds me of is like an instrument. You're going to get your sterling mark down here. 15 to start on this. It weighs 11 point something grams. You could use it as a spoon. All right, I wouldn't recommend it, but you could. And if there isn't any interest, I'll go ahead and throw it to the side. Hey, Susan, welcome in. Hello, hello. New on the card? Paparazzi earrings. Let's just do a $1 buy it now on these ones. They're cute. My elbow ain't greasy. <laughs> no greasy elbows. There we go. So $1 buy it now. Silver tone. Um, paparazzi drop earrings. Put that there, and let's see what else I got for you. Oh, I'm gonna do this one. There you go, folks. Let's see this one here. This one's a Danecraft, a Danecraft brooch. Hey, Michelle. Oh, welcome in. <laughs> You're fine, Rev. Let's do this one at a $4 start. Let the chef, you got your barbecue sauce here. You got your mittens, salt and pepper shakers. You got your grilling fork with a hot dog. You got your spatula. <laughs> uh, then you got your Dane Craft marking up over here. So give this to the grill master in this for the summertime, you know? Wherever the grill master is in your house, they need this. <laughs> I thought it was cutesy. Like how they put the kielbasa or, or hot dog or whatever it is that you want it to be. $4 to start on this. Again, it is a Dane Craft. <sighs> Holy crap. Look at that for a second. I want to check out this necklace. It's very heavy. It's very heavy. Okay. All right. Rev is in for four. Looking for five on this. Whoa. All right. And, <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Going once. Going twice. Last call. And sold. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right. This next one here, this one's really heavy. It's cool looking. So for this one here, you're looking at a... Let me get you a measurement. If I can find the right end of my tape measure, we'll be fine. You're looking at about 18 inches. So check out that chain. 
it is heavy and thick and then you got the toggle in the front there we're gonna do um let's do five on this one five dollars to start beautiful trying to i'm not sure if it's not focusing because of how much glare that's coming from this thing there's the back of it pose b is in for five looking for six you got your toggle on the front there Ugh. Hold on a second. Uh, got it. Okay. So we got pose being for five, looking for six. Got tons of weight to it, super pretty. Seems to be in excellent condition. And if there's no other interest, I'm going once to hose B. Going twice. Hey, how come I'm not typing? Last call. Um, and sold. All right, guys, two things. Can you hear me? The other thing is, can you see my stuff I put into the chat? I thought that was a true dog chain. <laughs> Second wrapper chain. Hippity hop. That's right. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. You can? That's weird. How come I can't see it? Let me... Ah, okay. We're better now. Cool. I fixed it. <laughs> that all just popped back up for me. Sorry about that. I got a cute little kitty cat. Now, it's not in the most perfect condition, but that's okay. We're going to do a $2 start on it. It is very lightweight, not marked. There we go. So it's got some scratches on it on the surface there. Very, what's the word? Like, would modernistic be kind of the word for it? I'm going to go with that. I hear you and I see you too. Yay, awesome. <laughs> Rev is in for three, looking for four. $3 on the kitty, looking for $4. What's that? Quartz, probably. Don't mind me, I'm talking to myself while I look at the jewelry, trying to figure it out. All right. I'm going to go once to wrap for three, looking for that $4 bid. Going twice. Last call, y'all. It's sold. Thank you, thank you. Sorry. Caught myself again. I didn't mean to. <laughs> All right, this here, this is 15 inches. 15 inches long. You get a lobster claw clasp on it. You do have a nice long extender on it. You got some uh, real pearls. And then I am thinking, these are faceted. These are definitely stone. I'm going to guess they're probably uh, a quartz of some sort. Not 100% sure. Let's do a... Four dollar start on this. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> so, like these ones here, like every other, are kind of like a light purple, so it could be amethyst. And then these ones are more of a white, and I'll show them better to you here in a second. So I think those might be a, a quartz, which would make sense. And then you got your real pearls. Nice and dainty, but super pretty. If I don't move, there we go. But they are ice cold. You got 15 inches long with a three inch extender. So these could very well be amethyst. There we go. Check out that guy. This one's cool. What is that? I do not know. <laughs> Let's be honest here. And if there's no interest, 
How about this guy? This one is marked. It's got like a flower as a marking. I'm not sure who that is. Maybe someone here in the chat will see. But there's like a flower right there. That's the only marking that I see on it. Uh, this one here is super pretty. It is missing a stone, unfortunately, which bums me out. We're going to do a $1 start. It is missing one stone. <gasps> Two stones. Oh, my God. Forget about it. If you want it for a dollar, you let me know. <laughs> it's nice, though. Missing two stones. Sorry about that. How about a cross brooch? Two dollar start. Silver tone. Sometimes you get so mesmerized by like the beauty of something, you don't even notice that it's missing a few things until it's too late. <laughs> Rev is in for a dollar on the one that's missing two stones. Thank you, Rev. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I'm not good at that, by the way. <laughs> Pose B is in for three on the cross. Julia, Julia, welcome in. Julia, Julia is in for four, looking for five on the cross pendant. Roach. Oh my God. Sitting here drinking water. I think it's sleepiness is what it is folks sleepiness retract on what rev the cross or the bro or the other one with the missing stones okay all right so we're gonna sell this one to Julia Going once, going twice, last call, and sold. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, this here, this is really, really nice. You got a sterling silver clasp. It is quite long. Let me get a measurement. Oh, you're looking at 18 times 2, 36 inches long on this. Oops. So you got your lofter claw clasp. That is sterling silver. Wait a second here. This is all glass and stone and pearl. I'm going to show it to you here. We're going to do this one at a $10 start. There you go. So again, you got a sterling silver clasp. You get your, all your faceted glass beads in there. You got some bicone beads, purple and like black colors. If I can get it to focus again, focus. You can do it. Hold on a second, guys. Sorry. Oh, for the love of God. Ah, okay, so huh. this really pretty bead, add, I'm going to go with glass on that. You got some pearls, some real pearl in there. It's beautiful. You got some amethyst in here, all kinds of fun stuff. Again, it is 36 inches long total. There you go. You got some bigger beads down there at the bottom, going towards the bottom. You have like the amethyst and the, like the focal, the focal bead. Like for ten dollars on this one. Any interest at all? And then the pearls are kind of like a, a, they're like a pinky purple color. All right. Let's see what else we got. Oh, I have a, is that a Roadrunner? I think it's a Roadrunner. I think that's the name I'm looking for here. I'm going to do a $3 start on this guy. There he is. 
you got the cactus there, you got the road runner, you got that, that old wheel hanging out. It is not marked. There's the back of it. It's cute though. Three dollars start on this little guy, and it's a nice little brooch. Uh, sticks out just a little bit on the end here for the pin. Hose B is in for four, looking for five. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna grab something else. Beep beep. <laughs> <laughs> Wiley Coyote. I had once found like a God. How big was he? He had to have been at least three feet tall. Wiley Coyote. Um, son of a biscuit. This thing is messed up. Uh, plush. He was so cool. Of course, I had to pick him up. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go once the hose B for four, looking for five, and then I threw him on eBay. And he sold within like an hour. He was just, he was awesome. Last call. And sold to Hose B for $4. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Oops. This next one is new with tags. It's got a $28 price tag on it. And, uh,. Do you like green? I got you here. Lobster claw clasp, gold tone, dark green, and like a lime green color. Let's do this one at a $3 start. Yes, I was so happy. I think I picked it up for like 5 bucks and I sold it for 85 So if you ever see a giant Wiley Coyote plush, grab it. <laughs> it has a little heart dangle down here. Just a little heart dangle. And then these are all acrylic. You go at your green, darker green stones, your darker green drops, and then your lighter green right here. There we go. And it's kind of like that there. Let's see. I'm digging, I'm digging. Let's go with man, I got some green stuff tonight. Lots of green in here. <laughs> Go with this guy. Well, I'd be stuck with it since I don't sell crap. <laughs> well, you could admire him. You could be a little buddy, you know. You could set a, a a chair for him at the table and such. Put an extra pillow for him on the bed. He was that big. <laughs> All right. Yes, you could always send it to me. That's right. And if there's no interest in this, um, if you want to give me two bucks for it, I'll take two. You'll let me know. This next one here is a loft. Let's do uh, $3 on the loft. You got your lobster claw. You got your little loft tag right here. Gold tone. Oops. Hold on a second. Let me get it sitting right here. There you go. So these here are like uh, very light blue acrylic pieces. And these are also clear. They're clear acrylic. There you go. $3 on this. Super pretty. I think the light blue and the clear stone combo. Like that. Hey, Christy. Welcome in. Thanks for coming. Okay, let's grab a few more things here. If there's no interest in the loft, I'll pull this one as well. This here is a... Oh, I thought for sure it would have been signed. It's not signed. It sure looks like a JJ or something, though. But it's not. We're going to do a $4 start. Nice heavy brooch. You've got the silver tone and kind of like the, uh, the copper color there. 
You got your calculator, your briefcase, your pens, and your paper. There we go. And then here's the back of it. And it, it has some weight. It's quite heavy. So there it is. Get your little your briefcase strap right down here as well. <laughs> Any interest in this? this little guy next. And if there's no interest on the briefcase, I want to replace it with this one. This is sterling silver. Cute little butterfly. We're going to do a $10 start. So it's marked and verified. It is a smaller butterfly. I'm going to turn down that a little bit. Needs a little bit of, uh, well, actually, it doesn't really need much cleaning. No, it doesn't. So there it is. You get your 925 mark over there. $10 to start on this little guy. You got the nice filigree in the wings there. There we go. And he is, or she, or whatever. It is. It, it, it. Come on. There we go. So just doing the wings. Uh, about three quarter inches, and then you can adjust the antennas the way, the way that you would want it to. So ten dollars on this little guy if you're interested. Sterling silver, marked and verified. I'm bringing it up nice and close. And if not, that's okay. It's going over here, over here. Let's see what else we got for you. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see this one here. Silver tone bracelet. I would, I think this is for probably uh, a, a man's. I'm not totally sure. Let me get you a measurement on it here. Or a woman's, I guess. Uh, eight and a half inches long. And let's do this at a three dollar start. There we go. So silver tone, nice wide um, chain, eight and a half inches. And it's in excellent condition. Leslie's in for three, looking for four. Okay. Three dollars, looking for four dollars on this one. Let me take this. Is this the one I was thinking of? Yep, it is. All right. I'm gonna go once to Leslie for three. She's going twice. Last call, y'all. Sold to Leslie. Thank you, Leslie. So I think this is also carved bone. It's a brooch. Oops, I want, I want this one. Uh, we're gonna just start this one off at uh, let's do let's do two dollars. Two dollars start on this. There we go. You got your nice little flowers there. Yeah, I think it's bone. Oh, well, maybe not. Let me bring it up closer to my face. You get the brooch there. Oh, what's that say? It says silver right here. I didn't test it or anything. Um, but yeah, two dollars start. I do believe it's bone. The little pin piece. It does say silver. It doesn't say sterling or nine two five, but it says silver. Did not test it. Not sure what that means, if it actually is sterling or not, or if we're just telling you that the color on it is silver. Any interest in this? There's your side profile of it there. It 
Julie comes in for two on it, looking for three. Two dollars, looking for three dollars. We're going to go once to Julie. Going twice. Last call, y'all. Fair warning. And sold to Julie. Thank you, thank you. This one is marked Alpaca, uh, Mexico. Alpaca, Mexico hammer texture bracelet. Let's just do a $5 start. It's a bangle. And you're looking at, um, oops, about two and three quarter inches in diameter. It is nice, huh, Sandy? So it is silver alpaca, Mexico, excuse me. You got the hammer texture, and then where'd the marking go? Uh, hello? There it is. Give my camera a second here to focus, if it will. Oh, great job. But I promise you, it says alpaca, Mexico, right over here. <laughs> Any interest in this? I'm gonna try to put it right there. Yeah. Mexico, alpaca in that area. Two and three quarters. I could get it on. I got big old hands. If it was bigger, my TP would wear it. <laughs> Mari is in for five on this, looking for six. Alpaca Mexico. Fancy. <laughs> I'm going to go once to Mari. Going twice. Last call, y'all. And sold. Thank you, Mari. For five dollars. All right, guys. Let's see. This one is shell. Yeah, shell and glass is what we're looking at here. Beautiful, like a like a pink, kind of like a darker pink. We're looking at eighteen inches. Um, let's see. Lobster claw clasp, silver tone of extender. There, you got your shell and your glass pieces. You got two strands. Let's just start this one off. Let's do two. Two dollar start. Oops. Uh, there we go. Got it. It's in great condition. You just get a little knot right here at the end of the, of the extender. I couldn't quite get it. I don't have a, a pin next to me to, uh, to do it, but if you had a little pin, it'll come out nice and easy. Oh, this one's cool. Any interest in this guy? Glass and shell. Focus. All right. The next thing I got, this one's a costume ring, but it's pretty sweet. It's a little, I don't know if it's a crocodile or an alligator, but, you know, something like that. Uh, you're looking at size six and a half. And we're going to do a $3 start. No, not 43 Three. $3 start on this one. He's pretty sweet, man. Then I got like that bronze color. You got all the rhinestones on him. You got little black enamel eyes. And it's not adjustable. That is soldered to his foot there. He's cool, man. Picky comes in for three, looking for four. There we go. Three dollars, looking for four dollars. Size six and a half. The rhinestones on the tip of his nosey there. Top of his head, his back, his feet, his tail. There we go. He's cool. You can have an alligator hugging your finger. Any other interest in this? 
I'm going to go once the pinky for three. Going twice, looking for that $4 bid. Mari comes in for four, looking for five. <laughs> What's up, Cool Ranch? What's happening? <laughs> uh -huh, I found you all. <laughs> Julia comes back in for five, looking for six dollars on this alligator. Mari's back in for six, looking for seven. <laughs> Julia's back in for seven, looking for eight. He's awesome, man. Look at him. Size six and a half. Picky, it's past your night night. <laughs> you sneaky ladies. <laughs> Mari's in for eight, looking for nine. Julia, Julia's back in for nine. He's pretty awesome. Check it out. You got it, Christy. Uh, where'd it go? Yes, right here. I got you. Thank you, Christy. Coot. So coot. Okay, let me just write this down real quick. Christy for nine. No, not for nine, for two. Excuse me. <laughs> Don't worry, Christy, I fixed it. We're going to go once to uh, Julia, Julia for nine. Looking for ten on this. Going twice. Last call, y'all. And sold. Thank you so much, you guys, for your biz. Appreciate it. Yes, does anybody have anything fun going on this weekend? Y'all doing anything or are we y'all just working? Get a work work. For nine dollars. Okay. Got it. Are you gonna like it? He's awesome, man. He's pretty sweet. You have to say, you have to admit. This here, uh, if I can get it out. Okay, I did. <laughs> this one's real pretty. It does have a circle spring clasp. Circle spring class, super long chain. You're looking at 30 inches long, and it's in perfect condition. So here is a type of chain you're looking at here. I don't know what you call that. It's got all those segments there. You got your circle spring class. Again, it's 30 inches long, and it's all awesome. There's your pendant on it. We're going to do a $5 start on this. It's a beauty. Bill me, of course. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What did I miss? What did I just miss? Send to Nikki, please. Okay, I got you, Julia. I just saw that. That's awesome. Send that to Nikki. I can do that. So here we go. 30 inches long. And it's got the enhancer on this. It is marked. It says... uh E pearl. E pearl is what it's marked on there. Beautiful. Beautiful green stone. You get the clear stones going around there. Five dollars on this. My favorite grandson's high school graduation party is tomorrow. I made his cake. Oh, awesome. What did you uh did you make it into something like uh fancy or like like a graduation cap or like a, a layer cake or a sheet cake. That's cool, dude. Send to Nikki. Okay, I got that down. Picky's in for five, looking for six on this. Let me turn off the lights a little bit. A hot pearl. Cool Ranch is in for six. Picky's back in for seven. This is beautiful. No tarnishing on it whatsoever. Again, you got the E Pearl down there. You got the enhancer. Susan's in for eight, looking for nine. Picky's in for ten, looking for eleven on this. 
right? That's awesome. So pretty. Ten dollars looking for eleven. <laughs> There's that. Let's see what else we got. We got a lot of stuff. Too much stuff. Uh, Susan's at 11. Picky's in for 12 on this. Looking for 13. This is green. A nice dark green. Beautiful dark green. Susan is out. Picky's at 12. Looking for that $13 bid. I printed a sugar sheet with his graduation photo and decorated it with the purple and silver for his cool colors. Awesome. Cool, dude. Going once to picky for 12, looking for 13. Going twice. Last call. I sold to picky. Thank you, picky. Thank you, everybody, for your bids. Okay, the next one here is a Cookie Lee. Cookie Lee. Let me stick this back in here. Uh, let's do a $3 start on this one here. All right, so here is your Cookie Lee tag. Another one that's in awesome condition. Lobster Claw Clasp. We do have an extender. You got three uh, chains, three strands. You got two, like, the roll chains, and then one that has, like, the ball and, like, almost, like, the liquid silver looking to it. And it comes on down to the cheetah print pendant down here. And then there's the back of that. Cookie Lee, three strands. There we go. And three dollars. What is that? I'll send you a pic. I have a printer with food coloring cartridges. I was wondering <laughs> how the heck you do that, but okay, that makes more sense. I don't get it. I just don't understand. <laughs> Any interest in the cookie leaf for $3? Oh, sorry, Leslie. Let's see. Let me put it down to its shortest length and then... We'll get the measurement here. Okay. So your length is uh, 14 inches long, and you have a 3-inch extender. So 14 inches with a 3-inch extender on that. Okay, I'm back. Leslie's in for three, looking for four. I'm going to go once to Leslie. My internet went out for a second, so hopefully everything's kosher now. I'm going twice. Last call. And sold to Leslie. Thank you. Thank you. Leslie, four, three. This next one here, it's a little lariat necklace. It is very dainty. Sorry. Whoops, 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 whoops. That's glass. Okay, that's all I need to know. All right. So, again, super dainty lariat necklace. Let's just do a $1 buy it now on this. It does have a little knot right here in the center. It'll take just a few seconds to undo it with a little something sharp with a pin. Just kind of weave it out. And you got your glass pearl and then your glass, your glass beads and then your rondelle. Cool ranch, I got you. Thank you so much. Let me know if you need one for Daniel. It's printed on edible sugar paper. You just peel it off the plastic and lay it down on top of your cake. Oh, so, okay. So you could actually ship that then. That's cool. You know what? I might take you up on that. His birthday's going to be here in a few months. 
right? Six, six, eight, ten. Hold on. <laughs> like four months. Oh my god, that was that was rough. Good night, Hosby. Thanks for hanging. Take care. <laughs> Anytime. This necklace, it's a cloisonne pendant. You got a barrel clasp. You're looking at 16 inches long. So there's your barrel clasp. It looks like, like that liquidy silver type stuff, but it's gold tone, of course. And it comes on down to the cloison A. Let's do three dollars to start on this necklace as well. Super pretty. But there's your pendant. It's easy to ship. Oh sweet. I didn't even know you could do that. I always wondered how you get pictures on the cakes, but that you just kind of explained it to me, so it's cool. <laughs> like, how do we do that? <laughs> No tarnishing that I can tell on the um, the chain or anything. Maybe a little bit on the clasp right here, but not not hardly any. But here's your pendant. Nice pretty butterfly on the flowers there. Yeah, and it's 16 inches long. It is. It is a butterfly on some flowers, and it's double-sided. So both sides have the same picture. Grab a sip of my water. Mm. All right. Mari's in for three, looking for four on this. Three dollars, looking for four. I want to go once to Mari. Going twice, looking for that four dollar bid. Last call, y'all. And sold. Thank you, Mari. All right, so seal for three. Jokey, oh, jokey. Let's see what else we got going. Oh, my God. I don't know. See, I got, I got jewelry all over the place, and I can't decide where I want to pick from. <laughs> um, this here, another barrel clasp. You got all the glass beads. This is kind of cool. Um, let me see. You're looking at 20 inches long. So there's your barrel class. You got all the, the cobalt um, blue seed beads. You'll look like a total professional cake, cake decorator. You're like, oh my god, you made that cake? I'll be like, oh hell yeah, I did. All by myself with my friend Cool Ranch in Colorado. <laughs> uh, let's do a $2 start on this one. Cobalt blue, it's in excellent condition. You got the gold tone uh, corals used as caps on all the facets of these there. They have like that AB coating. Do I have any earrings? Do I? Do I? Do I? Yes, I do. They're all in the bag. What I'll do is I'm going to put this down. You guys decide if you want that. <laughs> Two dollars to start. Is this an earring bag? What are you? Possibly? Mm. I have five billion pairs. <laughs> Go through that. Amy, not tonight. The only pair that I have uh, put out and ready. Um, uh, these paparazzi for one dollar if you want that one. That's the only one. That's a light estimate. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put this one off to the side there. <laughs> I know I got them. They're just not right next to me. <laughs> this one is super pretty. This is an Avon necklace. It's marked on the, the pendant. It's not marked on the chain, though. Let me just uh, there you go. fix that up a little bit. This is beautiful. I did, Nikki. Nobody saw my question. <laughs> this one is 22 inches long. It's beautiful. So, lo oh, no, not lobster. Circle spring clasp. You got that beautiful chain. 
Then it goes and goes. You got your really nice pendant here. This one we're going to do a $5 start. The pendant is marked Avon. You got like that hematite. You get the turquoise color. You got your Avon marking right here. And again, 22 inches long for this. This is a stunner. There we go. There's that. My earring drawers are overflowing. <laughs> cool Ranch is in for five on this, looking for six. This is really pretty. And I believe that's hematite. You got your turquoise color, uh, little beadings going around around there. There's your Avon. There's that. Right, Nikki? That's awesome. All right, we got Cool Ranch in for five, looking for six on this. I'm going once. It's in like new condition. Going twice. Last call, y'all. Fair warning and sold. Thank you, Cool Ranch. Four, five dollars. All right, let's see. Put that there. Um, I don't know. Let's roll with. I want to try. I want to try this. Sterling silver. I don't think I showed this one yet. No, I did not. <laughs> Sterling silver brooch. There's Marcus Sites in it. Marcus Sites. It looks. Is it? Is this one that's vintage? It's, it is vintage one. Oh my god. Hi, I can't talk tonight. Um, <laughs> really? Silver. Let's do a $18 start on this. Turn down my light a little bit here. So you got the basket with the flowers in it. And you get all your market sites going on around here. You got like the, the braided basket up there. Get your little flower sticking out over here. And then here's the back of it here. It is marked and verified. You got your marking over here. The pin does stick out a little bit. Of course, there's a little bend to it as well. So it would stick out more if it was uh, straight. But $18 on this. Nice vintage flower basket with the market sites. Put that there for a minute. I'm going to look for something else for you guys. If there's no biz by the time I get back, I'm going to pull it. I'm going to get that one out of here. Oh, yeah. oh this one's really cool. It's not cool. It's really pretty for better terms here. And it's itty freaking bitty. All right. So this is going over here. This is tiny. It's a tiny little bracelet, but it's vintage. And it has cameos. Let me get you a measurement on it, too. So bear with me here while I get this sitting on here. All right, so you got your two cameos. You got your little, your little cross. It's a fold-over clasp. Uh, we're going to do this one at a $4 start. I always, I did, oh, I spelled it right this time. <laughs> but you get your light blue cameos. It's very, very lightweight. And the measurement on this here, you're looking at about six inches. There we go. Oh my God, why did, I, why did I even touch it? There we go. So it needs a cleanup. There's your cameos. You get a little heart charm right here. You get your little cross charm. Here's how the cameos are set. There's the back of it. I think so. I didn't test it, Sandy. Uh, not Sandy. Cool Ranch, sorry. Huh. I did not give it a test. But I think it's Silver Tone. I've been wrong before. Yeah, definitely Silver Tone. Huh. Man, this magnet's strong. Holy smokes. There we go. 
<laughs> so Cool Ranch is in for four. Looking for five on this. Six inches long. I'm going once, Cool Ranch. Going twice. Last call. Ouch. And sold. Thank you, Cool Ranch. Appreciate it. Cool Ranch for four dollars. Okay. Let's do. Oh, look, an owl. Hootie who? Hootie who? Let me get them fixed up here. Okay, so this is on a really long, a really long gold tone chain. He has a little bit of tarnishing up around the ears and the eye there, or well, the ear, or the eyebrows, whatever. Wait, what? But check them out. Okay, look at. So hold up. Let me fix it. We're gonna do. Uh, let's do four dollars start. Wait, what? <laughs> Four dollar start on this guy. He's super pretty, man. You look at it all three inches. You got the AB colored um, eyes right there. And then usually when you see them, they have the articulated like three or two segment body. This one's all with like the the hanging charms here. It's so cool. No me a hootie. <laughs> Gold tone. Oh, silver tone, right? I'm the same thing. And that's what you're talking about. Picky's in for four, looking for five. He's super cute. Got a little bit of tarnishing up here, but that's all white. Sandy's in for five. Look at those little eyes. Ooh, ooh. He's awesome. <laughs> Five dollars looking for six dollars. Picky is out. Same Rhonda. I totally understand. <laughs> Going once to Sandy for five, looking for six. Going twice. Last call and sold to Sandy. Thank you, thank you. And AB eyes. He's so pretty. Oh, so pretty. Uh, five. Weird. I don't see the five. You don't? It's right underneath Sandy's. Oh, he's cute. That's weird. Yeah, do you see Sandy? Did I put down Sandy? I did. That is weird. No? What the? Odd. <laughs> Sandy's at seven. Wait. Wait. No, Sandy, you won this for $5. You're good to go, Sandy. Unless there's a six that I did not see. Just double checking everything. Okay. That's odd. This is a really nice um, cross charm bracelet here. I'm going to try to lay it out the right way. Okay, you got the rhinestones on that one. Okay, so you got your lobster claw clasp here. Oh, I got it. We're going to do a $3 start on this. Three dollars to start. I'm not going to move around with it much. It's in great condition. These are acrylic beads. And then you get your five crosses. Are you in top chat? Sandy Kirk for five or all of you? That's in block the other. Oh. That could be Cool Ranch is in for three, looking for four. Three dollars, looking for four dollars on this. Oh man! <laughs> Come on. Okay. 
I'm just digging around here for a second. Um, okay, all right. Uh, Susan's in for four, looking for five. Super pretty. Excellent condition. Cool Ranch is in for five, looking for six. Next. Here, five dollars. Looking for six dollars. Oh, there it is. I was looking for a pendant. I posted for like hours, and it was in front of my face the whole time. Stupid. <laughs> God. If Susan's in for six. Looking for seven. Cool Ranch is in for eight. Looking for nine. Susan's at nine, looking for ten. Thank you, guys. And Cool Ranch is out. Okay. I'm going to go once to Susan for $9, looking for that $10 bid. Going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And sold. Thank you, Susan. Thank you, Cool Ranch. Okay. The next one here, this one is marked and verified sterling silver. And we get the three kiddos here holding hands. It's marked 925 Mexico. It's also marked EFS. And then it says uh, save our children as well. We're going to do a $15 buy it now. Let me get it to focus here. Okay. So you get all your markings back here. It does say save our children, EFS, Mexico 925. And then you get the little kids holding hands. Cute little brooch. And you're looking at about, oh, two and a half. Well, two and a quarter-ish. Fifteen by now on that. There they are. Save our children. If you change your mind on this, you just let me know. I have a little cameo hat, hat pin, stick pin. Let's do $2 to start on this one. $2. It looks like it does have some maybe yellowing from age, or maybe that's the way it's made. Right, Susan? Definitely for the right person. There's a side of it there. Here's the back of it. And it has a little the protector down there. Two dollars on this guy. Any interest in this? And if not, I'm gonna take it and put it over here. This costume ring, it's a size 10. Size 10, let's do a $2 start on this one here. And you get all the colored um, enamel in there. You got red, purple, green, yellow, blue. And they have a little bit, well, no, it's not shimmery. It's just shining off the gold tone underneath there. And it's in great condition. It's unmarked. There's a little bit of scratching down here at the bottom. Size 10. Good night, Picky Nikki. I'm going to be taking off here soon in a few minutes. I'm going to go 
I don't know, relax in the recliner, and I think I'm going to watch some Shameless tonight. Cool Ranch is in for $2, looking for 3 I was watching Supernatural, but I, I, I watched like nine episodes, and I just can't get into it, so I'm calling it quits. I give up. I am on late. <laughs> So I moved on over to Shameless. Go on once to, actually, you know what? I'm going to go five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Cool Ranch. Thank you, Cool Ranch. You're watching uh, Shameless? I watched some of it like four or five years ago, and um, I decided I wanted to start over and, tr and do it again. <laughs> okay. Um, you know what? Let's do, I'm going to do two more items. How about that? Two more items. She missed us. What about this one? Wait, is this one okay? Are you okay? Yeah, she's fine. We're going to just do a $1 start on this little guy. $1 start. Little, uh, beetle or ladybug. I don't know. Uh, little, little brooch. I was watching it. I did uh, I did about nine episodes, and I just I couldn't get into it. I tried. I really did. I like the actors in it, though. They're all awesome. Mari's in for a dollar, looking for two. Any other interest in this? Oops. I'm going to go once to Mari. No, I'm not. I'm going to go five, four, three, two, and one. Sold to Mari. Thank you, Mari. Mari Cecile, one dollar. Tiffany, please send that out to Cool Ranch for her brand new store opening up eBay. Do, do, do. Let me reach over. Are you talking about the owl, Sandy? Is that what you're talking about? Season 7, episode 19. I'm going through the baggies to see what you bought. I'm having a brain cramp. Susan Arrington, who's talking to me? Sandy Kirk. <laughs> who's talking to me? <laughs> but let me know, Sandy, if that's what you're talking about. <laughs> and then my last item for tonight, um, let's just roll with, uh, let's do the swan brooch. Let's just do a $1 start on it. It's got some weight to it. This is cold to the touch. I'm not sure if that's stone or like a ceramic gold tone. It's got a little bit like light tarnishing to it, but it's super pretty. You got that, like that white and then you got like the peachy color. And here's the back of it there. And I finally listed a few things today. Felt good. Just like three things though. It's okay. Better than nothing. Mari's in for a dollar. Looking for two. I'm trying to figure out what that is. I think it's ceramic. I mean, no glass, glass. Hello, I think it's glass. My mouth doesn't want to work anymore. I'm gonna go once to Mari for a dollar. Going twice. Last call. And sold. Thank you, Mari. Let me change my camera here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. Uh, I know it was a late one. Um, I'll be back on tomorrow night, one hour earlier, so it'll be 10 p.m. Eastern. I'm going to do a little bit of jewelry, probably an hour, hour to two hours I'll be on for. Um, you guys have a great rest of your night, morning, whichever, and I'll see you guys later. Thank you.